Hello everybody, my name is Jill and welcome back to another episode of Ellen Wake. We are going to reach the mirror pick lockout and meet the kidnapper, I think. I hear that. Right. Again this boss fight. I can burn them. They're not coming for me. They are. I don't know if I should waste my time. Please don't fall. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fucking troll game. I hate you so much, game. No. Please. Don't. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate parkour. Uh, nothing bad happened. Everything is normal. Birds. Yes. Please, please don't fall. Bridge collapsed because of the birds. If that makes sense, blame the birds for that. Well, thank you again for that. Worry. Don't trust anything at night time. It's night time. So I'm not supposed to trust anything. Danger. Do not enter. Okay, let's enter. Drop it. And we're inside the cave. Mine. Exit the silver mine. Oh no, is this like a labyrinth? I hope it's not. I think it is. Please don't get lost. Come on, how the fuck am I supposed to exit? Okay, please. Don't force me to do that. I hate you so much. Oh my god, I hate this game so much. Why do you do that to me? Am I supposed to do something? I don't have anything. Oh. You do. You're so blind. I don't think I'm supposed to trust that voice, even if I think that voice is Alice's. Don't trust anything in the dark, because I guess that voice is from that old lady. Flares. That's a good sign, enemies are around. Okay. Manuscript page. Preparing me for something that I don't like. What? Oh shoot. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? It's just not fair. Okay, use the show. So okay. Yo, bitch. You're going to die, okay? Come on. That was the fight because it's just fair. Standing there where the enemy will pop out from nowhere and be attacked. Because it's fair. I don't have more ammunition for the shotgun, which is kinda bad because the shotgun is bare. Okay, that's a dead end. And another labyrinth. I'd have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. Yep. I'm sure the machinery can help. It can be used again. Come on. Oh, parkour, my parkour skills don't fail me now. Please don't collapse. Okay. <laughs> I'm not dead, so it 
that's good. And now we're just gonna switch. And go up. Like... It's not okay. I'm not sure where I'm going. That's the thing. Please don't die. I'm going there, okay. So, what it's here then? Use something. So, maybe for later. To get there. I think. Okay, it's just a puzzle. Nothing more. Glad I didn't go this way first. Don't die. Please. Okay. I'm close. Is this the right path? I don't know. Okay, I can go down here. Use that thing again. Come on. And that's it. Come on, don't hit escape. Climb, climb. Lazy ass, you're so slow, Alan. Come on. That wasn't that bad. Except the fact that I was attacked, I was flanked. And I didn't know. That was the worst part in all of this. And I see dark. It's still night. Don't trust anything. Probably that voice was just ghosts. I guess I'm supposed to go up here. I see flares. This is just an optional thing. I can tell. It's a page. I think that's an optional thing, so... <coughs> wrong way. <coughs> What's the other way? Because there's no tutorial in this to show you where are you going. So we're going down. Okay. I hear the crows. Shit. Fucking crows. I'm still I'm I'm attacked. Even the crows attack me. So fuse box. Goodies. Give me those goodies. Reload this. Reload the weapon, Jesus. Car. Just great. Yep. Hopefully you won't find this. Like, you won't survive. Where are we going? I have a bad feeling something bad is gonna happen. Like, I don't know. The music and the cries. Go behind. Die, bitches! Don't dare touch the cable. Cable car, please. There. Don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. And I'm alright because it makes sense. Are you kidding me? Hmm. 
My aim sucks. Okay. Go for that. Oh my god. Shit. You can go here. Please don't fall, trailer. Or wagon. Go in the light, go in the light, go in the light, go in the light. Okay. First, open the fuse box. It's more important than the safe point. Okay, anything here? Just this. Just cans. Are you kidding me? Okay, let's go. I think we still have a little bit of going. I don't know, I'm not sure. The music, you hear it. Don't want this, the hunting rifle. Shotgun is OP. It's bear, bay. It's my bay. I hear. I hear ya. Bitch. Okay, just follow the path through the forest at night time because it's the best idea. But he does all of this because he wants to find his wife. Oh my god, it's getting darker. Safe point, oh my god, thank you so much. Give me everything you got. And Cauldron Lake. Oh my god, Cauldron Lake? The lake that everyone thinks doesn't exist. Bridge, my favorite thing. Oh my god, isn't this a bridge from the beginning the beginning of the game? I can't run. Something bad is gonna happen, I have a feeling. Like I don't know. Some oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on bitches, you're afraid of flares. You're just afraid of flares. Oh my god. I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna quickly destroy ya. Destroy was an enemy over here somewhere. Is that a big guy? I think that that's a big guy. Are you kidding me? I can load now. There's one more enemy up here. That's a coward because he's just throwing shit. Okay. Better watch out for enemies, I don't want to be killed. Like that. Okay, checkpoint reached. Okay, there's an arrow, so I guess somewhere over there it's a... chest with goodies, okay. Let's just have a look because it's close. Flare gun. That's really good actually. And then just follow the path. Not wasting my time. How nice. And why are the bridges always broken? Destroyed? This is not fair. Okay. I have a bad feeling something's gonna happen, but that's a horror game. Everything could go wrong in a horror game. Kick it or push it. My poor parkour skills don't fail me. Kick it. Kick it. Destroy the nature. Alan, oh my god. A burn house. I heard that. Can I go in the basement? Oh my god, I can. I can go to the basement. Tom, Tom. Um, Tom, 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 Tom. 
someone is obsessed. I curse you, Thomas Zane. Tom Tom Tom. Did you write this? I miss you, Tom. Uh, Tom, you talk to me on TV. Tom, Tom, miss you. I can go inside the house. Oh my god. Do I want to go inside the house? Is this a good idea? Or is this supposed to be like how you're crossing the ruins? Oh my god, please don't collapse. House. Flares. That's a good sign. I got so many flares and I don't want to use them. Is this a good idea to come here? Boss fight. Nice. At least I got flares. Holy shit. And this. Now I'm glad I checked that box. Die, bitches. Cells? Is that still something? Bitches. You're asking me to do this. Answer. You're just asking me. You were just asking me to do that. Reload weapon. Okay. Well, I had a bad feeling something is bad is gonna happen. So, that happened. Now, my question is, can I go back? Can I go this way? Yes, I can, but hopefully my parkour still skills won't fail me. Okay. And... I heard that. Like a blink. Hopefully nothing bad is gonna happen. Like it might been I could Fallout? see Cauldron Lake. I thought I could make out the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. Alright. And what about... if it's not I was a boat. close now. I had to get there fast. I dreaded what I would find. Okay. Wait! Is that you? Wait! Hey, I'm here! I'm coming! What? No! Get away! Sorry! Please, please! The boss didn't know who he meant with! I didn't know! Who is that? Is that Barry? Sorry, I haven't played this game for a while. Can't remember things. Oh no. Oh no. He's he is he possessed too, I think. Is that episode just episode three? End of episode three, okay. Skip it. Previously on Alan Wake, I'm haunted by the law. Sheriff, Wake's running. I'm giving chase. Are you seriously telling me that writer just took out my deputies? A thriller I supposedly wrote is coming true. The genre of the story seems to be shifting. <sighs> it's turning into a horror story. I was told that Alice had been kidnapped. But that was a lie. We don't have his wife. We don't know where she is. Her purported kidnapper was eaten up by the dark presence before it attacked me. Episode 
episode for the truth. Alan, shh, baby, it was just a nightmare. You're in my Alice. There Hartman, I fell. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. I... You went through another rough period. What? Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. No, you're... you lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Fast. It's okay, okay Alan. Just, Just let, let go. go. go, 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 go. <gasps> so his wife is dead. And... I felt groggy. Whatever Hartman had bumped in me was making me numb. I felt like this was happening to someone else. Someone I was watching on television. I couldn't think. Couldn't focus. The door was locked. I was a prisoner here. Maybe that's your mind. Can you write? You can't. Can I do something? Straight the door. Good evening, Alan. Are Hello. we feeling better now? Feeling calm? Yeah. No. I see you brought your pet gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message. Loud and clear. Quite right. That's the spirit? You're being very brave, Alan. I understand you're confused. I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. I don't blame you for it. Big of you. Now, why don't you come with me? We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Little walk and some fresh air? Yes, it will do you good. Follow Dr. Hartman, okay. This corridor is for patients. Most of them aren't here right now. Jack oh, took them out for a fishing trip. Except for the ones who are particularly vulnerable, of course. I encourage creativity as a part of the recovery process here at Cauldron Lake Lodge. I specialize in treating artists. I bet you do. Splendid, Alan. I honestly believe we can get this thing under control if we work together. I don't believe that. This way, Alan. I can't go anywhere. In the elevator. That's not a good sign for me. Now, Alan, from past experience with you, I know I need to get right into the heart of the matter as quickly as I can after an episode. So I'm just going to say this. Alice is dead. No, she's no. not. You're in a very vulnerable state until you understand and accept this. Alice drowned. And you couldn't face that. You're suffering from hallucinations, paranoid delusions, unusual thinking, an obsession about light and darkness, a feeling that everything revolves around you, your thoughts and He's dreams. He's a fucking writer. Your mind has constructed an elaborate fantasy scenario in which your writings are affecting reality. She has been kidnapped and supernatural forces of darkness are trying to stop you. That's true. We go this way, Alan. I wasn't ready for another shot, so I went along with it. He had to be lying, but under the influence of the drug he had given me, I had to fight not to believe his words. Don't believe him. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Apart from the tragic accident with your wife, no one has been killed. Your delusions are just a manifestation of your subconscious mind trying to protect you from the too painful truth. Unless we fight the fantasy, it will return. I know the instinct is to resist me, but think about it. Doesn't this make far more sense than the insane supernatural conspiracy you have concocted in your mind? No. You're a skeptic by nature, Alan. We both know this. Everything can be explained logically. No, I can't. You don't say that, okay? Oh, look, it's clock. In ten breaths. Read. Beyond the shadow you said of war, there's a miracle illuminated. The memory of a dear friend and a poet. Me is the poet. I mean, I'm a writer. He's a writer. 
So, what kind of hospital is this? I see coffee over there. Ah, I see you coffee. Never get tired of this view. Very inspiring, isn't it? Yep. Cauldron Lake spread below us. I could see Mira Peak on the other side of the lake. I thought I could make out the spot where Diver's Isle had been when I arrived with Alice. Now there was nothing but waves. And it's thunderstorms. It seems there's a storm coming. Funny, I don't recall there being a mention of that in the weather forecast. Well, no matter. This way, follow me. Don't want to. Alan, what I'm telling you is good news. Right now we're in control. Every time you have a relapse, it gets more and more difficult to resurface from the dark depths of your imagination. Not surprising, considering your profession. Imagination is what you work with. After all your nightmares, this should come as an immense relief to you. If it doesn't, why is that? Because I'm lying? Or because you don't want to admit that you're not well? It's very natural you're for lying. you to think of me as your enemy. It's part of the illness. I let him talk. After all, Hartman obviously loved his own voice. His words echoed madly inside my head. But I, can't I dug my nails into the palms of my now. hands to stay you focused. You need to work with me. That's Once good. you accept that, we can begin the journey towards your recovery. Okay. Come along. Let's go inside. No. What the fuck are you doing? Uh, here's the entrance to the office wing. That's for staff only. Scary, scary, scary. All right. <laughs> Emerson. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a real bad dream, mister. You should be afraid of me. Don't want to run into me in the night, that's for sure. Please, Emerson. Mr. Wake is confused enough as it is. Yeah, you'd like me to go away so you won't be scared. But you can't just decide what kind of dream you have or when you have it. Emerson. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No. That's Ooh. Emerson. We're actually making some progress with him, I'm happy to say. He works on video Elbow games. Strike. It's yeah. trash, of course, yeah. but yeah. it does involve I'll some small yeah. creative effort, which makes him receptive to my therapeutic methods. No kidding. La, 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 oh my god. La, 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 so I'm in a hospital. Come out Prince this person. way. Now, you might have noticed the typewriter in your room. You've been writing as a part of the therapy. As soon as you feel up to it, you should continue. I think I am. Oopsie. Am I staying in your way? Where are we going, huh? My rheumatism's killing me. There's a storm coming. Oh, what a storm. I hope it wipes this place off the face of the earth. And these two are the Anderson brothers. Odin and Tor. They had a... How should I put this? A heavy metal band in the 70s and Is 80s called Old Gods of Asgard. They even adopted new first names to complete the image of Viking gods. After the band broke up, they lived on a farm nearby. They are, well... In advanced stages of dementia. I don't care. They're well oh cared for. TLC and Please all that. The There's nothing more that can be done. Let I'm afraid life. that Please. the rock and roll lifestyle has left its mark. Can I do something else except find oh, this doctor? Do. I'm so sorry to cut this short. For now, Alan, the power has been acting up. I'd better go check on it. We'll continue this soon. Meanwhile, when you feel up to it, return to your room and try to write. It really is for the best. Don't you think? I'd like to bash his head in with a hammer. Oh, he'd love to fish out our secrets, but he has no clue. He's not crazy enough. <laughs> not crazy like us, Sonny. Yeah! Being crazy is a requirement, Sonny. Who else could understand the world when it's like this? It takes crazy to know crazy. That's the sanest thing I've heard in a while. 
Oh my Say, God. you're all right, Tom. Hey, we like him, don't we, bro? He's got to go to the farm. The Anderson farm. Valhalla! We wrote it all down, lest we to forget. A crash course. All you need to know to get your head right. You need to find the message. Here, Sonny, here's something for you. Gave me a rash, but I kept it safe from these bastards. Okay. My head was clearing up, or according to Hartman, I was sinking back into the fantasy. I was convinced he was lying to me about everything. Crazy or not, the Andersons made more sense. Tom, you got any booze on Okay, I think this is going to be it for yeah, this episode. Uh, no. <laughs> We're going to return to our room in the next one, so...